see what I'm saying? Sales goes along this edge of the forest. And um, I, I made sure I spared some special plants, trees like this one. You know, I don't cut just anything. I make sure, you see, it's beautiful little special piney trees, okay? So, um, I cut usually weeds, you know, and bushes. And um, you see, here too, I spared this little tiny pine trees, so I don't cut useful trees and plants. So only, you know, only weeds, nuisance, you know. And even animals are happy, you know, because the crowds also can come down and get the insects eats and all of that. And um, anyways, this is the end. So I have to cut through here all the way there, down there, you see, up there. Actually, this is, this is steep uphill a little bit, not too much, you know, but um, so, but um, before I do that, you know what I have to do? Yes, here, here I am, you know, so I'm going to put this down right, like that, you see, so that I can put down also my bag, and I have to pause for a minute, okay, see I'm back, I have to do another, another checking for ticks, okay, without recording, so just a minute, I'm back. So I think I'm going just straight, just straight all the way, and I'm right there, I'm gonna be hit the, another hiking trail, so that's gonna complete, it's gonna connect my place flat with the hiking trail here. So I have to go around, whatever, you know. And it's pretty nice here. It's a lot of wildlife, you know. Like I seen deer this morning. I seen snake yesterday. It's always something I seen. Uh, deadly spider some other day. I had to kill it with machete. What can I do? It's, it's really deadly spider. I can't leave it if I see it, you know. Because this way, yes, spider web there. So this way, you know. So you're actually helping some animals which spider is attacking. So I'm going to be, I'm going to put it in my pocket, okay? And hope it keeps recording while I have to use the machete, you know? And then, um, it's like you see this bush here. It's pretty hard, it would pretty hard to cut, you know? But if you cut it at a certain angle, you know, if you know how to apply the the inertia force of the machete, okay, the the weight of the steel, okay, the way you do it, you just set the like a hammer, you know, fall down without too much force. I guess you see, you see, it's done. Just one hit and away you go. And um, it's actually awesome. Oh, it's very hardy. So, <laughs> tell you what, I mean, this machete is very dangerous. Um, we can make a broom out of this. Some arts and crafts, you know, that's what it's called, bushcraft, you know. So many things you can do, and, and that's what I'm into, you know. And that's what I support and um, promote and advertise whatever it's called <laughs> oh only 50 minutes this is giving me great exercise you know and it's awesome beautiful tree the terrain is you know it's a little hilly it's always like little hilly rolling down and sideways i mean my ankles sometimes hurt it's very difficult. It's it's not your ordinary hiking trail, so um, you gotta be careful where you step and everything. Still, like here, I'm gonna be leaving this 
this roots and all, you know, I'm not gonna be cutting unnecessary, you know. But let me show you I, the power of this machete. This is what I've cut yesterday with machete, okay? Because you can use machete instead of an axe if you know how to do it or whatever, right? If you, just like any other tool, if you have more experience, like I've already cut thousand <laughs> mosquito, already cut a thousand plants, you know. I, I you know, I stopped counting things, you know. And um, in Vietnam, they attack us with these machetes, you know. So it proved out that the guns and the bullets are not like Superman, all powerful, you know. There is a kryptonite weakness. Achilles feet to everything. And that swordmanship, the power of the blade, the sword. So this is only for educational purposes, like I said, I don't go, I'm not crazy. I don't have energy, you know, to waste either cutting unnecessarily. So every time I do is for scientific educational purposes only. I made that disclaimer loud and clear many times, so um, in case of any if any rat bothers, because I don't know if you know, word rat has a multiple meaning. In some language, word rat means war. Somebody who brings war, conflict. That's what the rat is. Nothing to do with that animal or whatever. Like I said, has a multiple meanings. So yeah, I can joke and dance and sing whatever God knows. So, but when I'm working, you know, when I'm working with these tools, suddenly I'm no longer, you know, laughing or anything. Oh, I forgot I had this. Oh, some insect attacking me. So usually in this area, so thing is. So guess what, I'll have to take the shirt off because of this. Ferocious bees, they attack around this area always. Well, this is wilderness, okay, this is. It's just annoying, so I have to, I have to now be a, like a Muslim, you know, that this is what it is, you know. People think this has nothing to do with religion, it's a, to help cover from the heat of the sun or insects. So, um, I had to put it on like this, so that the bugger would leave me eventually. <laughs> Another way is to start the fire, which I didn't because I'm recording, so I can't do everything, you know. Even though I'm always trying my best, God knows, so that he may be satisfied. So this is the, the machete that I got, and I know how to use it well, you see. Cutting these pretty hardy branches. And with this machete, they can cut even like an axe, you know. So let me try one more time, but it's already almost an hour. Yeah, it's always I forget something, you know. Always forget the hat, the protection from these guys.
Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of cut cubes. A lot. See what I gotta cut through sometimes. Otherwise, you can't walk through, you know. Oh. But I'm, it's just here, you know, so a few more feet and will get easier. Although I'm tired much from yesterday, I don't know. Can't do much because I was doing too much yesterday. Because of the good weather, you know. So when you have good weather. Take advantage, you know. Ah, oh. easy. What's this? Kind of fall. Yeah, I just was thinking this morning to get a hat from Vietnam. So I'm almost out of here. I think it's gonna be going uphill, so should be hopefully less vegetation, although there's a lot of the bushes, hardy plants. Even grass, like ooh, everything grows crazy. Ah, oh, it's roses right there. Roses. I hate roses. Gosh, it's thorny. Let's have the right here. This in the way. Um, can just remove a few branches. Don't have to completely cut. So you can that's complete or not. Ah, here it goes easy. I have to cut the bushes. See what I'm saying? This is a jungle, baby. Welcome to the jungle. We have fun and games. We got everything you want. So it's gonna be getting easier. But that's it. I already, you see how much I worked yesterday having to cut through all these bushes, not just plants, you know. 
it's like cutting tree branches even more difficult even more difficult it's easier to cut tea branches than these little bushes which are very hard it's very hard to cut see this guy here but if you cut it a certain angle you see second size then so let's try again yeah, try another angle it goes away see here you go first one lucky and it's gone Please giggle if any I have missed before, okay? On my way back, I can take care of them. You know what I'm saying? Sorry, we're not doing that boy thing. Voice when I'm working. I can't disrespect. I need all my attention, concentration and can't have joke and fun at this time so hope you understand it's, there you go just have to find him a spot G spot right See how much I work here. You see a bunch of old pile up stuff here. God knows I didn't record. I can't record everything, okay? Because only when I'm not recording, I'm like going through this like a beast, okay? But recording takes some of my Concentration, of course, and mindfulness, which I need completely in order to be more successful at this, what I'm doing. So that's what I've done so far, going back now. I'm sweating like a pig, you know. So I have to go and drink and eat breakfast. I didn't have breakfast yet. I had um, chocolate, you've seen, and coffee, and tea. And here you see suddenly, you know, wiggling around the trail. But you can go just right through this, just fine. Here is a little bit, a little bit, oh yeah, it's hurting my ankle, so, guys, go. Oh, these fucking bees following me. So excuse me if I finish recording. Peace and God bless.